Alright guys, it's a super windy day today, but it's my first day off in a couple of weeks. So I'm going to try to enjoy the spring drive and give you guys some POV shots of just cruising. I've already passed like five cops. One even turned around at the gas station and waited for me to leave. Then I passed two on this main road. So we're just gonna be cruising. Bunch of rain over there, so we'll probably hit that. But we're gonna get some footage while we're out.
get a little walk around, eh? Oh, a little update for you guys. I didn't do any install videos. Yeah, no install videos, but I'll give you an update. We got some new pedal plates. I'm loving this one for the dead plate. It screws right into your plastic OEM. You gotta drill holes for these guys. The gas pedal plate still needs to be put on and adjusted because the holes that are pre-drilled on that one is too close and it touches the welds. In the back, I don't know if you can see that. We got some new Chasing J's hardware. Great detail. And the titanium shift knob, I'm loving this bad boy. It's a little too small. I wish it was bigger like the Fat Fork Custom one I have. But it's a nice little switch up. Bunch of junk over there that flies around on corners. Very irritating. Oh, and then I got the Chasing J's radiator cap. Another nice little touch. I did buy the wrong one for a Civic. So if you guys own a Civic, I have this exact same one that fits Civics and S2000s and I'll send it to you for free. Just hop on my IG and uh, send me a message. There was a local guy that wanted it, but he didn't respond back. And damn, my hood bra is fucking up this carbon fiber hood. You can see like some white going on here and some freaking weird bubbling or something down below this clear coat. But I love the way this car looks without the hood bra with the carbon hood and those little buttons. Super nice. So, what, oh yeah, it's got some new hardware too for the skirts. Titanium, these guys are super nice. So what's coming up though for this build, you guys, I have a foot plate that's coming in for the driver's side. Something I, I've wanted a long time ago, but never plan on doing it. So I got rid of the floor mat. I got some metal shavings down there, but you screw it into this and uh, hopefully it doesn't screw things up, but it's gonna look nice. I have a half cage roll bar that's gonna go in the back. My only issue, I think, hopefully it's not for a two door. So hopefully it doesn't like affect the, the way it bolts in. But there is a guy that I know that builds cages actually from that town we just came through. So I can get it extended or adjusted to get it put in. But you bolt it in here and you bolt it in down there. And it's a bar that goes across. I didn't get the crossbar because I didn't want to mess with my seats. So that's coming in. It is build to order, so I have to wait. I have new lower control arms coming in. Those are coming in, in May. A new rotor to try to fix the shake. A new axle, and I'm pretty sure it feels a lot better. Today's drive has been really smooth. And one thing I noticed is this right here is missing that. So it would rattle when I'm driving, and I would be like, it would feel extra shaky to me, because all I would hear is this, and I thought it was this. But the whole time it was this. So I ended up buying this rubber seal, sticking it back here. It takes away the sound and the car just feels smoother now so it's super dope <laughs> pretty cool uh, the trim is painted black now I'm not sure if I updated you guys on that yeah I did that's black now I gotta finish up the bumper I need to buff it repaint the side this guy right here gotta redo that guy I still need to clear coat this quarter panel but I've been dealing with the shakiness wanting to fix that so I can enjoy the car and drive for this beautiful spring weather we have going on here so 
So there's an update on some things that are going to be coming up. I don't know if I'm going to do any install videos of the stuff that's coming in, but I'll definitely show you guys what it looks like after. Excited for the cage. That's something I've always wanted. I'm also thinking about getting the Chasing Jays extended piece that goes right here. It's got a dimple die and some titanium. That might give it some more oomph in the side. I need to clean this paint. Get all the road debris off it. Clay bar it, basically. Because to you guys it looks white, but right now you look at it closely, it's like a a darker color you can see some dark nastiness going on that's for my decals oh and I also got new radiator hoses I'm not sure if you guys could scroll back and you'll see that but one of my hoses were starting to freaking expand in the back so I ended up but that's about it let's keep driving Good Lord. 